Hello, welcome back. Today I'm starting a genetic algorithm tutorial with with neural networks. So we can start now. And in the next videos we will see the code in C++ and a practical example in in a run engine to to make the, a simulation of a car a car an artificial intelligence driving car so now we can start the the first thing we we going to see is the initialization and then the we we will loop into the fitness fitness function the selection crossover and mutation uh, we will loop until until we 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 reach a, a solution that that helps us. So now we can start. The the first thing we we're gonna do is the initialization. As I said in the introduction of the video. We will use a neural, a simple neural network with weights that are initially size between zero and one. A uh, a very useful word that a very typical word in this in this algorithm is the population and the generation. The population is the number of individuals that are in each generation and in each generation you select the the best uh, individuals so in your criteria in your own criteria uh, to to reproduce in to into the next generation it's like like human generation works and every every animal works so uh, and the chrom the genes are the weights that we are going to use, and the chromosome is going to be the output layer of the neural network. So now we can start defining our fitness function. That that is going to be the 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 function that that returns how how properly the the neural network the genetic algorithm works it it's going to return the a value between zero and one and in our practical example that we are going to see later uh, we will we we will use when we finish the the time of completion in it in the track that that I've designed because we want to 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 select the fastest uh, the fastest neural network to to run in a race and then we are going to make race between within between the the best neural networks and uh, bet the between the best uh, genetic algorithm so it would be such such fun. Then we we need to to select the best the best uh, individuals in each generation, and there are a lot of a lot of selection types that that are very very famous and and today. The I think the 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 best is the tournament selection that works like like a competition. Uh, some of of the individuals compete for for surviving, so the only the best survive. But in a, like in a competition, so the the worst the worst individuals has uh, very few probabilities to survive and 
the competition is won by by the is won by the by the individuals that has a more percentage a more probabilities to survive it works with probability so a less the the worst individuals can also go to the next uh, to the next step in the competition so it's like a bit random but with probabilities i i like the most the elitism that consists on on a very few a very simple algorithm that only maintain the individuals that has the best the best <coughs> the best fitness in the in the in the population but it, it has a a uh, problem because we 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 may not uh, uh, reach a a, lo a global minimum and we we may reach a, a local minimum so I I particularly no no like not like this this one because because of that we can also say uh, we are we are going to use the roulette wheel selection that it fills with all the population uh, probabilities a, a, a roulette like like in the casino and and we and then we we select randomly a uh, 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 the 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 population that we want to to go to the uh, to the next generation. The the crossover that is very very common in these in these days because like like human works uh, we need to cross over our cro crossovers uh, to to have to make sim uh, differences and similarities bet between the two parents. Well, we first select uh, randomly or in the in the way you want to to individuals of the of the population. Then we uh, we select a, a crossover point that in this example is the in the in this point we select a crossover and then we say we make a, a new a new a new po a new individual in oh, we can make a an, an, a two, two two individuals or one we we may want to to select this and combine with this and the other individual is going to be this with this part so from from two parents we can we can have a two two liter sums. Then the, the the next step that we're going to follow in 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 this genetic algorithm is the mutation that is really important to maintain the diversity of the population. Because we want to to uh, to have different individuals and we can also uh, um, have this uh, in our fitness in our fitness function because it's very important to maintain the diversity and, and we can select the the individuals uh, from from the ones that that are that has a a rich select diversity values and we can measure these these types with the distance between the the weights of each individual. Well, in the mutation, our weight is going to change in a move proportion 
with a random number between minus 1 and 1 because our weights uh, can be negative or positive the, this, need, this is very important because some values could be could, uh, uh, could, could not be important and we need that and I have written this this simple example that uh, how this the the mutation works. Only we can select a uh, a uh, fifty percent of the of the weights can be modified, or you can change uh, uh, with a random number. So this is not very important. Oh well, a moment. Okay. Now, now we can see better. And we we will finish our our gene our improvement in the gen in the neural network when when the neural network has has converged and and has reached a, a global minimum. And we know that that it hap it happened when when the generation n is is similar it's very similar to the gener to the next generation so that's all if if you want to if you have questions about this topic or if you want to 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 make a better explanation of of this make a make a comment and leave it leave it back and subscribe if you if you like these these kind of things and in the next in the next tutorial i will i will teach you how to how to make a a neural network in in c++ that you could you could extrapolate these these language we into other other kind of language because c++ is very intuitive and you could understand and I would implement it that in Unreal Engine because we we want to to view this this kind of improvement in in, in a practical example we will we will use a, a track race in which cars we will will compa compete to to win and not to crash because most in the in the first generations they they crash very quickly so see you in the next video and bye